What sort of bike you got there, Francesca? Is it a foldable one? It's the Yarra Edge cheap fold up bike. Melbourne Exhibition Centre. What kinds? Yeah, I was going to bring mine. It's arriving at Crown Casino. We're now east of St Kilda Road, Flinders Street Station just behind us, alongside the Yarra River. Alright, I just like the hard way that clearly, clearly these kayaks have right away. Almost got coat hanged. Paul is our ride captain today. Who are we off to, Paul? Uh, well, we've just ventured uh, from uh, Docklands and we're now gone past Southgate and South Wharf. And we're proceeding towards along the river towards the tan there. And we'll divert over the bridge at um, Ferguson Street, uh, heading around the river towards IKEA, which is up Richmond Way. Alright, sounds exciting. MCG just back there, Rod Labour Arena, Amy Park, the sporting and entertainment precinct, heading eastbound along the Yarra River. Just to the right is a place called the tan and good to see the people out enjoying their breakfast some making on the I had a megaphone that was weird the very distinct design of Amy Park right on the Yarra River Plenty of people having morning breakfast, sun tanning, bike riding, walking, and rowing. Crossing the Yarra River at Amy Park. Under the M1 Monash Freeway, or City Link, on a suspended bike track. Freeway, river, bike path. That's close to go to the freeway. The freeway is right there, Monash Freeway, linking Melbourne to the eastern suburbs. Well, we're pushing about 10 k's out of the city. We're taking a loop to the north, and I'll tell you what, there is more bicycle riders on this than a peak out of the Piedmont Bridge in Sydney. Yeah, it's a lovely. Lovely trip along the river. We've passed Q, so we've been far Q. Far Q? Yeah, far Q. Yeah. Now we're going towards um, Hawthorne. Yep. And around, which will eventually get us up to North, a good way. But I reckon we'll get to IKEA in Richmond and that'll be our final destination point for something to eat. Then we turn around and come back. And Chaskin, basically. I must admit, Francesca, this little bike here, I was thinking it wasn't going to go the speed of a, uh, a uh, toddler trike, but it has some guts in it. Alright, oh, so in case you didn't hear that. 
the uh, extreme athlete from Philippines said, it's not the bike, it's the athlete. Well, as you can see, the uh, track here is fairly busy. Yeah, river is very brown. Very good cliff tops over here too. A lot of bushes. The shades here keeping us uh, quite cool. Paul, just where are we? Uh, we're nearly, uh, we're about uh, five kilometres west, east of North. Very precise, thanks Paul. Thank you. Check my bike. Let's see if it's, it's heavier than yours. Okay, hang on. That's I film Paul riding down the steps. Are you? I'm worried having a... We're in the suburb of Abbotsford. We're taking to the streets. Yeah, I was going to say, I've been to the zoo down here, or a farm. Yeah. Alright, very good. We're now city bound, back heading west towards the city, along the river. I was surprised how much it flows here. Just went through the uh, Collingwood Children's Farm, or Abbotsford Children's Farm. And the journey continues. This went through the uh, Collingwood's or Abbotsford Children's Farm. Look how far and fast the Yarra River flows. This is a uh, canoe practice ground, the captain just told us. Well, that K1 um, canoe, like that Sam Fox race is in there. Yeah, and it turns around quite dramatically here, doesn't it? Yeah. It flows down. You can see the markers over there. Bit of a lookout up there as well. I never knew the Yarra River did this. Here we have more hills. A lot of hills here. Well, I really have no idea where we are. Now, our ride captain up there. He seems to have got himself a bit geographically embarrassed. It's a nautical term for loss. So we're just trying to acquire a uh, bike track back to the city. We're 18 kilometres since uh, we left the Yarra's Edge. Sun's up there, that's west, so we are heading sort of southwest. Hopefully, the uh, ride captain will re establish our course. With our ride captain, Paul, what's your thoughts? So we may as well keep continuing this way. I reckon we've got about 10 kilometres to go and we'll come in at the bottom of uh, Docklands where the wheel is, the former wheel is. Harbour Town, yep. Yep, Harbour Town. And there should be a coffee shop slash somewhere to eat just up here in um, Brunswick Road area, somewhere up here. So, sort of winging it a little bit. Okay. Well, here we are, Brunswick Road. Road where these, on the other side of this building, there should be a coffee shop. And a bicycle shop on the bike path. Well, here we are at Fitzroy North, just at a uh, coffee shop to uh, refuel up Francesca. Yep. How do you feel now? A bit better, but it would be better if on our way back we avoid the hills and we just go. Yeah, it should be all downhill now, so coming into the city, but uh, yeah. Otherwise, the trams are just there. What'd you order? My food, we get bacon and egg roll. 
All right. Well, from Fitzroy North, it's all downhill into the top end of the city, and it's all further downhill back to Dockland. So I have not pedaled in the last minute. We're just coasting along and doing 25 k's an hour and just cruising. This is uh, the Royal Exhibition Centre, I think it's called, just in there. And what I've noticed coming down this street here is people having picnics in that strip. It's about the fourth or fifth uh, picnic I've seen happening. Melbourne Museum to our left, and we're literally right on the edge of the city. This will bring us out the top end of uh, Spring and La Trobe. That's all a downhill run into Harbour Town Docklands. As you can see, uh, Melbourne's very bicycle friendly. Bicycle paths everywhere to encourage this mode of transport. All the city streets now have these divided bike lanes. We're at Burke and Russell and uh, right uh, next to us is a Ferrari that we just raced down the uh, end here and yeah, we won. Yeah, couldn't keep up. Here we are in the Burke Street Mall, riding down the tram tracks. Watching out for pedestrians. <coughs> and just on 29 kilometres, here we are back at the starting point. Baldy Bridge, Marina, IGA. Yeah, there's uh, 29 k's in two hours 38, I think. No, three hours 38. Well, here we are, 30 k's back at the starting point. What an epic ride. How long did it take, G? That took uh, three hours and 39 minutes. Uh, so three hours and 20 minutes. But we stopped uh, a bit. We had some good lunch. Yeah, yeah, That, burger, that, that spicy chicken burger I had was very, very tasty. Good. That was um, the best part of the morning. Yeah, I bet it was. And uh, yeah, thanks for, sure is. That's fine. thanks for taking us on this journey. Uh, it, was, it was my pleasure. I'm, and, uh, I'm glad everyone had a great time. Absolutely. And uh, yeah. now we should. Do it again tomorrow yeah, morning, eh? Yeah, we'll do it all again. To, Before to, work, yeah? yeah, yeah Excellent. Epic adventure. Okay. Epic. Highlights? Highlights? Uh, the finish line. Highlights? Hills. <laughs> Unforgettable my, hills. My highlights? Everything. Everything. Uh, all right. Live from uh, Yarrow's Edge. Paul, Frankie, and I'm the G. Thanks for watching. <laughs> my hands. My legs hurt so much. Paul, I hate you. How can yeah. you do this to me? Yeah. Oh. Is your throat 